Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the morning phone call. We'll start with technical and derivatives outlook. So we start with Nifty. Uh, on Friday, we saw that there was a selling in the market and we lost around 320 points uh, during the day. And the low which we saw on the Friday session was uh, 17,779. So overall, if you see from the top, we have already corrected 1,100 points and which is close to 5.87%. So the... The range for the Nifty, which the rally we saw was from 16,747 to 18,887. And with uh, Friday's session low, we have almost corrected the 50% of this rally. So what we believe in the earlier, we maintained that there, there was a possibility of sell-off. Uh, 17,800, we were maintaining that that would be a level where market can come and we will see some support. So now looking at the weekly and the monthly time frame, we believe... Uh, the market will be in the range of 17,000 to 17,500 to 18,500. So this is the range for the Nifty. So immediate for the week uh, on the bounce back, 18,000 will act as a inter intra-week resistance, but then the higher side range will be 18,500. So uh, net net, uh, whenever the index comes to close to 17,500, I think we should be looking for the buying opportunity. We have a positive view in the market so, uh, since there can be some uh, pre-budget kind of rally. So it's not very uh, clear, but then uh, we are at the lower side of the lower edge of the market. So definitely the buying should be coming at from this level. Coming to a bank nifty, uh, bank nifty was also down by 740 points, uh, which is close to 1.75%. Uh, 1 so what we saw was the ma uh, majorly most of all the banks were down, but PSU Bank was something which were the which affected the most. So even the bank Nifty uh, earlier forty three thousand was the level after which breaking that the market uh, bank Nifty started coming down. So now the support level for the bank Nifty is forty one thousand and higher side forty three thousand will act as a resistance. So this is a two thousand points range for the bank Nifty. Uh, Stock specific, we the Axis Bank and ICCI Bank were the two counters which didn't uh, affect it much during the last correction. So whenever the uh, bank Nifty stabilized, uh, Axis Bank and ICCI Bank will be the one who, which can find support and there can be some trading bounce in the counter. So coming to the derivatives data, so Nifty Futures has seen a short build up to the tune of 5.66%, which was the addition of 7.34 lakh shares. Uh, the put call ratio is 0 0.72. Uh, so as long as it is staying below one, it is slightly on the negative side. So if the maybe in next couple of days, the mark, if we see some correction and the put call comes to 0.6, then that will find support from the derivatives point of view. The major additions were seen in the 18,000 call option by 93.84 million shares and then 18,200 call options by 87.53 million shares. On the put front, 17,500 put options by 46.59. So the 17,500 and 18,200 uh, are the range from the derivatives point of view. Bank Nifty has witnessed long unwinding to the tune of 1.38%, which is a decrease in OI and the reduction of 40,000 uh, 40, shares. The PCR uh, did uh, uh, also decrease from 0 0.72 to 0.67%. So that's slightly a concern. And the additions, major additions fan seed is 42,000 call options by 21.23 million shares and then 41,500 put options by 14.57 million shares. The top three long builders were, uh, the, were uh, granules, uh, uh, DVs and, uh, and, uh, and CIPLA, whereas the short builders were ID, IDFC first, uh, About India and Nestle. Uh, coming to FI data, FIs are net short in the market, so they are net uh, 20,000 contract shorts uh, with the long short ratio at 43%. So we, so FIs coming below 50% is a is a slight concern. So we believe that so whenever uh, it, the ratio goes above 50, we can say that they are positive in the market. But right now they are selling, they are selling index future, so they are hedging their positions. From the FIs point of, uh, from the derivatives point of view, the long build ups are seen in. Uh, DV's lab and CIPLA. So that can be in a watch list. And the short built up is uh, Nestle, India, and Krasim. And lastly, the from the sector point of view, 
so most of the sectors are already corrected the auto is one which is in the oversold zone and it is approaching its 200 day simple moving average so there is a fair chances if market takes support the auto can be the one which can find support so we'll keep a watch on auto specifically uh mnm and uh, uh maruti which are positive or judged it is weak it is continuously making a lower low so uh, any bounce in it i think there will be a selling pressure in the it and uh, secondly the psu bank also which eventually rallied a most has also corrected and now is approaching the uh, 50 simple moving average so if the market finds support then auto and psu bank are the one which will first start to rally and from the Friday's closing point of view, only the pharma sector is one which was holding the market. So sector, uh, only the pharma will see some kind of trading bonds, CIPLA and, uh, and DVSLA. These are the trading bets. So uh, that's all from mine. I'll hand over to Vishal sir for more uh, research updates. Yeah, good morning, uh, team. Good morning, sir. Uh, so to start up with, uh, continuing with what the judges mentioned, so even if you look at uh, US, uh, then, you know, uh, historically uh, around 75% of the time, the US stocks have risen uh, during the last five trading days of December and the first two days of uh, January. This is, I mean, as a terminology wise, uh, I mean, this is termed as a center rally and uh, uh, probably like, you know, historically uh, things have been 75% uh, of time. It has been uh, like that, which is like, you know, market has been on a move and the reason uh, for this uh, pattern is like you know uh, overall there is a low liquidity because there's a holiday season in us and then there's a tax law loss harvesting which people try to do and then investing for a year and uh, bounce uh, so we look forward uh, to that i mean the same thing happens in this year uh, or not which actually starts uh, uh, I mean, like, you know, from today at this end uh, in the first two days of uh, January. Uh, coming on the, uh, in terms of uh, fundamental and uh, news flow perspective uh, to starting up with the uh, bank. Uh, so uh, RBI has released uh, 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 my mistake. So, so uh, I mean, like, you know, trade growth, the trade data has been released uh, uh, by the ship. And then if you look at total number of uh, credit card in force continuing to remain uh, uptrend. And uh, for the month of uh, November 22, it is up by around 19.5% on YMI basis. Uh, net card addition during the month was around 1.3 odd million. Uh, though, I mean, like, you know, vis-a-vis -vis the October month, this was a little lower, but overall, uh, the, the growth rate is continuing to remain strong. Uh, from the major players' point of view, uh, the net card addition is led by SBI, HBFC Bank, Excess Bank, Excess Bank, and they continue to add a number of new card on the net uh, basis. Our ICICI bank has witnessed a downtick uh, of around 1.1 lakh, uh, lakh cards in the month of uh, November. Uh, the card spend, again, uh, they continue to uh, remain uh, positive. And uh, I mean, like, if you look at the total card spend, uh, I mean, like, it has breached uh, 1 lakh, 1 lakh, or uh, uh, 1 lakh crore, which is 1 trillion mark for the ninth consecutive month. Uh, which basically mean the consumption side the continue to remain strong and overall this is uh, uh, fundamentally i mean it is good for the the credit card companies and plus uh, the consumption uh, as a whole uh, at an all india level uh, next is on wipro uh, so the wipro has announced the acquisition of minority stake of less than 20 odd percent in us space uh, computer vision company uh, for a cash con cash consideration of 1.5 uh, million us dollar overall i mean if you look at the size wise it's pretty small uh, so, may not be uh, add much, but uh, sentiment wise, it's positive uh, for uh, August well for Vipro. Uh, next is on Ashok Leland. So, as per the uh, uh, commentary from its executive chairman, Mr. Dhiraj Hinduja, uh, the uh, company has mentioned, like, you know, they continue to maintain, they continue to work towards maintaining a market share of 30 odd percent. Uh, as, like, you know, demand for buses and trucks uh, looks uh, pretty positive. And in the coming months, company has a planned number of uh, launches. And uh, I mean, like, you know, uh, if you look at the company, continue to build uh, competitive products and organizational capabilities of future odd uh, products. Uh, just to give you perspective, uh, I mean, like, you know, um, in, the, in the month of, uh, that is like, you know, market share of 30 odd percent uh, for commercial vehicle segment, uh, uh, I mean, has been seen in the July to September or quarter for this company. And uh, Chennai-based company has recorded a gain of around 9.6% uh, in uh, quarter two, uh, and like, you know, which is on a volume uh, front. So this is this August well, and uh, company con uh, commentary again continue to remain positive. Uh, next is on uh, uh, Simmons India. The Simmons has bagged a contract with Indian Railway for the manufacturing and maintenance of electric uh, uh, freight uh, locomotives. The contract size is of around 11 odd years, and uh, 
the total estimated contract value is around uh, 26 or 1000 of crore uh, this is uh, positive for uh, cement india overall i mean if you look at from uh, uh, capex point of view uh, the two uh, government entity which is like you know roads and then railway they continue to uh, maintain a positive traction and we are expecting that like you know the same thing will be there when like you know in the around one month down the line when the budget will be announced uh, so this this is uh, good for the stocks in uh, particularly in uh, railways and then uh, second is on uh, the construction road construction uh, space uh, next is on Tata Motors. Tata Motors subsidiary uh, TML uh, CV Mobility Solution has signed a contract with the Delhi uh, Transport Corporation for the operation of uh, 1500 electric buses in, in uh, New Delhi. Uh, so overall, it's positive and um, uh, Tata Motor will supply and operate around uh, uh, 1,500 12 meter uh, low floor uh, air conditioned electric buses for the period of uh, 12 odd years. Uh, next is on SJVN. So SJVN has expanded its uh, footprint in wind energy at it, as it has won uh, full capacity uh, of like, you know, uh, making 100 megawatt uh, wind power project at a cost of around uh, with daily supplying power at a rate of around 2 rupee 90 pesos on a build, own and operate uh, through a reverse uh, e-auction uh, basis. Uh, this is a positive for SGVN. And then uh, last thing from my side, like, you know, uh, the Quest Corp, the company has said, like, you know, due to change market scenario, the company has decided to withdraw the proposal of uh, uh, amalgamation of LSEC technology with the company. And uh, I mean, like, you know, this is basically, uh, there have been a lot of concerns on, like, you know, when this uh, proposal on mouse and now the company has uh, uh, taking its uh, proposal back, which, which uh, from market point of view, it is positive. And plus, uh, they have announced, like, you know, the company is appointing uh, Mr. Kamal Pal Huda as a group CFO, and he'll be replacing the existing one. Uh, so so uh, that's all from my side, and I'll head it over to team now. Over. Uh, thank you so much, Vishal, sir. Good morning, everyone. So further news updates are, uh, Honda Cars India on Friday said it has tied up with Indian Bank to provide vehicle finance for its customers. Gandhar Oil Refinery Limited has filed preliminary paper with the Capital Market Regulatory SEBI to raise fund through an initial public, offer, initial public offering. Pharmaceutical firm Lupin Limited on Thursday said its US-based arm is recalling four lots of quin Quinpril tablets used to treat high blood pressure due to the presence of a nitrosamine impurity. A Bandhan Bank is in the advanced stage of talks to sell a large part of its entire stress microfinance loan portfolio to the Kotak Mahindra Bank backed Phoenix Arc. Uh, Japan's MUFG Bank has executed a rupee 450 crore sustainable trade finance facility for Tata Power. This credit facility was extended for the solar project under TP Kirnali Limited, TPKL, incorporated into 2020. TPKL is a 100% owned subsidiary of Tata Power Renewable Energy Limited. IFC, a member of the World Bank Group, has extended a dollar 400 million or over rupees 3,300 crore loan to India's largest private mortgage lender, HDFC with an objective to boost green housing in the affordable segment. Vedanta Limited on Friday said it has been declared as a preferred bidder for Bicholim mineral block in Goa. The iron-owned mines has resource of 84.92 million tons. And Tata Motor subsidiary TML CV Mobility Solution has backed a contract from the Delhi Transport Corp to supply, operate and maintain 1,500 electric buses in the city for 12 years. Suin Pharm Pharmaceutical Advent International has signed a binding agreement with the promoter to acquire significant stake in the company. The private equity firm will make an offer to acquire an additional 26% stake in the drug maker. Vipro, the company, has bought a minority stake in the US based Kipsi Inc. for $1.5 million. The acquisition is to build a partnership in the computer vision application. Alchem Laboratories, the company will sell. 8% stake arm engine uh, bioscience to fund for rupees 160 crore. Proceeds from the sale will be used for capacity expansion in India and the US. Lastly, Siemens, the company, has received a letter of award from the, from the railway ministry for a 9,000 horsepower electric locomotive project in Gujarat. Thank you, everyone. I'll hand over to Hitendra for further Hindi updates. Yeah, thank you and good morning everyone. I'm a call quite by the Mikadete. 
स्टार्ट करेंगे जैसे यूएस स्टॉक्स में जनरली देखा है ड्यूरिंग जो लास्ट फाइव ट्रेडिंग सेशंस होता है और फर्स्ट ट्रेडिंग सेशंस होता है न्यू ईयर की हमेशा एक सेंटा क्लॉज रैली है थोड़ा सा हमें रिलीफ रैली जैसा दिखता है ये सी एफ आर ए के रिसर्च डेटा से देखा तो सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंट ऑफ द टाइम ये रैली हमें मिला है बेसिकली ये अट्रीब्यूट करता है लो लिक्विडिटी और टैक्स लॉस हार्वेस्टिंग है उसके चलते होता है और जो इन्वेस्टर्स उनकी ईयर एंड बोनसेस को भी थोड़ा वो एन ई वी का लेवल्स बनाने के लिए देते हैं सो इन्वेस्टर्स को लग रहा है कि इस बार जो यू एस मार्केट में जो इतना मंदी पर था उससे थोड़ा सा लास्ट के पार्स में थोड़ी सी रैली आती हुई दिख सकती है बट ये क्लियर होगा जैसे सेकेंड ट्रेडिंग डे ऑफ ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी का ने अनाउंस किया कि उन्होंने एक्वायर किया ट्वेंटी परसेंट माइनॉरिटी स्टेक एक यूएस बेस्ड कंप्यूटर वर्जन कंपनी में किप्सी जो कि डेढ़ बिलियन यूएसडी कैश में उन्होंने किया है किप्सी का बिजनेस है ये डेवलप करती है एंड टू एन इंटीग्रेटेड एनवायरनमेंट डिजाइन जो कि बिल्डिंग कंप्यूटर वर्जन अपलिकेशन और जो कि ग्लोबल कंप्यूटर वर्जन मार्केट में इनका वायलेशन कुछ करीब बारह बिलियन यूएसडी का है ट्वेंटी और ये लगता है ये एक्सपेक्ट कर सकती है ग्रो ट्वेंटी वन बिलियन तक यूएसडी सी एच आर में सी एच आर ऑफ सेवन परसेंट में सो ये वेपरो के लिए अच्छी न्यूज है क्रेडिट कार्ड का भी डेटा देखा गया अगर डेटा वाइज देखा गया तो नवंबर में जो ट्रेंड था वो अपट्रेंड में ही था टोटल एटी पॉइंट सेवन न्यू मिलियन कार्ड इशू हुए जो कि उन्नीस परसेंट हाइयर ईयर ऑन ईयर और वन पॉइंट सिक्स का हाइयर है मंथ ऑन मंथ पे अगर नेट कार्ड देखे गए तो 1.3 मिलियन कार्ड्स टोटल अभी तक हो गए वर्सेस 1.7 अक्टूबर प्राइस में सी मेजर प्लेयर्स देखे जाए तो एस बी आई बैंक और एक्सिस बैंक के थे जो कि कंटिन्यू कर रहे हैं अपनी रेडिंग पोजीशन हाउएवर आईसीआईसी में थोड़ा सा डाउट देखा गया वन पॉइंट वन लाख कार्ड्स का स्पेंड्स के अगर देखा जाए तो वन ट्रिलियन मार्क के आसपास का ट्रेंड कंटिन्यू रहा है नाइन कंजर्वेटिव मंथ है और इसमें देखा जाए तो ये मच वन पॉइंट टू ट्रिलियन था और अगर हम वैसे ओवरऑल स्पेंड देखे जाए तो 11.2 परसेंट डाउन था मंथ ऑन एंड बेसिक वॉल्यूम ट्रांजेक्शन था और जो अगर वैसे देखा जाए तो 8 परसेंट डाउन था हमारी जो कि इनलाइन एक्सपेक्टेशन के बराबर था हमें आगे जाते हुए लगता है कि फर्दर मॉडरेट और ओवर नेक्स्ट कवर ऑफ मंथ थोड़ा सा मॉडरेट ही रह सकता है क्योंकि फेस्टिव सीजन भी अभी थोड़ा खत्म हो चुका है इन्फ्लेशन इम्पैक्ट भी थोड़ा सा कंज्यूमर स्पेंडिंग पे इम्पैक्ट कर रहा है बट हम वैसे भी कंटिन्यू रहेंगे बुलिश रहेगा हमारा व्यू ओवर ओवर बैंकिंग सेक्टर पे तो टॉपिक्स हमारी रहेगी एच डी एफ सी बैंक आईसीआईसी बैंक फेडरल बैंक और सेंट्रल यूनियन बैंक एक न्यूज में देखा जाए जो हिंदुजा ग्रुप की फ्लैगशिप कंपनी अशोक लेलेन वो वो उन्हें लगता है वो कॉन्फिडेंट है कि थर्टी परसेंट का जो मार्केट शेयर है वो कंटिन्यू करेगी सीबी सेगमेंट में और जो उन्हें वो एक मार्केट मार्क को भी जुलाई सेप्टेम्बर क्वार्टर को उन्होंने पेच किया था और ये उन्होंने कहा कि स्पेशली नया ऑटोड फ्यूज सेगमेंट लॉन्च कर रहे हैं चेन्नई बेस्ड कंपनी के साथ जिन्होंने नाइन की क्यू में उनका मार्केट शेयर था थर्टी के आसपास सो so, इसे देखा जाए तो डोमेस्टिक सेल्स में अच्छी इन्हें मदद मिल सकती है हेवी एंड कमर्शियल व्हीकल्स जो एम एच सेगमेंट में है और वॉल्यूम देखा जाए तो एक सौ तेरह परसेंट भागा जो कि पच्चीस हजार चार सौ पचहत्तर था और प्रीवियस ईयर जो कि बारह हजार था जो कि मोर देन डबल था टाटा मोटर्स ने कहा कि जो उनकी टी एम एच सी वी मोबिलिटी सोल्यूशन है उन्होंने एक साइन किया कॉन्टैक्ट डेली ट्रांसपोर्ट कॉर्पोरेशन के साथ जो कि बसेस पंद्रह सौ इलेक्ट्रिक बसेस सप्लाई करेगी और ऑपरेट भी करेंगे अगले ऑपरेट और मेंटेनेंस करेंगे पंद्रह सौ बारह मीटर की लो फ्लोर एयरलाइन बसेस में भी बारह साल के बीच में रेट के लिए सीमेंस इंडिया ने भी एक बड़ा कॉन्ट्रैक्ट पार्क किया इंडियन रेलवे से फॉर द मैन्युफैक्चरिंग इनको मैन्युफैक्चर करना इलेक्ट्रिक सेट लोकोमोटिव को और ये कॉन्ट्रैक्ट रहेगा इलेवन ईयर्स के लिए इसमें इन्वॉल्व होएगा प्रोडक्शन 1200 सौ हाई हाउस पावर एच पी के लोकोमोटर्स और ये लोकोमोटिव पैंतीस साल तक ये थर्टी फाइव ईयर्स तक रहेंगे और रेलवे फैक्ट्री लाहौर में मैन्युफैक्चर होगा ओवरऑल अगर प्रोजेक्ट कॉस्ट देखा तो छब्बीस हजार करोड़ का है और दोनों पार्टी जो है वो नेक्स्ट पार्टीज का नेक्स्ट थर्टी डेज में कॉन्ट्रैक्ट साइन करेंगे एस जे वी एन ने भी एक्सपैंड किया अपना फुटप्रिंट अपने विंड एनर्जी बिजनेस में उन्होंने एक हंड्रेड मेगा वॉट की कपासिटी विंड पावर प्रोजेक्ट एट द रेट ऑफ टू पॉइंट नाइन पर यूनिट के हिसाब से बिल्ड ओन एंड ऑपरेट बेसिस थ्रू रिवर्स ऑप्शन में मिला है नेक्स्ट न्यूज है क्वेस्कॉप ने क्वेस्कॉप ने कहा कि हाँ क्योंकि मार्केट के चेंज चलते सिनेरियो के द बोर्ड ने डिसाइड किया कि जो उनका माल कमीशन प्रोसेस है एनसेक कंपनीज के साथ टेक्नोलॉजीज के साथ और जो उन्होंने अपॉइंट किया है कमल पाल होटा को एज ए ग्रुप सी एफ ओ जो कि दस नवंबर दस जनवरी दो हजार तेईस से रहेंगे जो कि एंड रिव्यू में शाना तक भी जगह रहेंगे अगला न्यूज देखा जाए तो होंडा कार्स देखिए फ्राइडे को उन्होंने टाइप किया इंडियन बैंक के साथ जो कि व्हीकल लोन प्रोवाइड करेंगे अपने कस्टमर्स को गांधार ऑयल रिफाइनरी ने भी कह
रिकॉल किया गया है बदन मैगनी की मैं वो एडवांस स्टेज है टॉक में जो कि अपने लार्ज पार्ट सेल करना चाहते हैं जो कि स्ट्रेस माइक्रो फाइनेंस को अनोन प्रोफेलर कोटक महिंद्रा जो बैंक है फिलिक्स पी आर सी को जापान की जो एन एफ जी बैंक है उन्होंने कहा कि उन्होंने लगता है साढ़े चार सौ करोड़ का सस्टेनेबल ट्रेड फाइनेंस जो फैसिलिटी टाटा पावर को है ये एक्सचेंज कर सकते हैं सोलर फिलिक्स अंडर टी पी करनाली लिमिटेड को जो कि ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी में और ये कि हंड्रेड परसेंट ओन सब से टाटा पावर के लिए आई एफ सी जो वर्ल्ड बैंक के एक मेंबर है उन्होंने एक्सचेंज किया चार सौ डॉलर मिलियन का जो कि ओवर थर्टी थ्री हंड्रेड करोड़ लोन टू इंडिया जो कि एच डी एफ सी को दिया गया है और ये बूस्ट करेगा ग्रीन हाउसिंग और अफोर्डेबल सेगमेंट के लिए वेदांता ने कहा कि फ्राइडे के लोनों में वो एक प्रेफर्ड बेटर डिक्लेयर किए गए जो कि बेचोलिंग का मेंटल ब्लॉक है गोवा में और यहाँ से वो एटी फोर पॉइंट नाइन टू मिलियन टन आयन और एक्स्ट्रा कर सकते हैं सुविन फार्मा ने भी कहा कि जो एडवेंट इंटरनेशनल एक बाइंडिंग एग्रीमेंट साइन किया है प्रमोटर के साथ जो कि एक्वायर करेगा सिग्निफिकेंट स्टेक कंपनी में और एक ओपन मार्केट ऑफर से होगा जो कि एडिशनल ट्वेंटी सिक्स परसेंट वो स्टेक बाई करेगा एलकेम बैग ने भी कहा कि वो सेल करना चाहते हैं एट परसेंट तक जो कि एंजिन बायो साइंस में है जो कि दो फंड को सेल करेंगे एक सौ साठ करोड़ में रहेगा जो प्रोसीज रहेगा यूज करेंगे कपासिटी एक्सपेंशन जो कि इंडिया और यूएस में रहेगा सो दैट्स इट फ्रॉम माइंड थैंक यू रेवेन फॉर अटिंग द मॉर्निंग कॉल कॉल यू नोटिस करेक्ट